Hey guys, this week we're talking about stuff to do in Boise, Idaho, and this week is our part one of the series, and it's going to be The Village at Meridian. So stay tuned and we'll get right to it. Hey guys, my name is Randy. I'm a realtor with Next Home Treasure Valley. This week, like I said earlier, we're going to be talking about, this is going to be like a series that I would like to do, stuff to do in or around Boise. The first episode is going to be about the village at Meridian, which as you can tell, isn't in Boise itself. It's actually in Meridian, but it's just a neighboring city. When I was talking to the owner of my brokerage, I was asking him about ideas and he's like, well, why don't you do a video on the village? And I was like, you know what? I had a friend, a longtime friend that just moved to Idaho a few months ago, and I've heard her talking about the village a few times. So anyways, I'm going to kind of go into a little bit of details, and I shot a bunch of footage that I'll be interchanging. In fact, you've probably already been seeing that footage uh, now. So so a lot of this information I'm getting from buildidaho.com. The website is very informative about the village, so you can actually check it out there, and you can kind of read some of the stuff. The village has over a hundred commercial tenants it includes a playground a skating rink in the winter restaurants it's got of course stores that you would be used to seeing at a mall it's got big owls it's a bowling alley slash like video arcade it's really kind of cool it's got a movie theater that they actually sell alcohol in at least they did last i checked so it's kind of a really cool place to bring either the family or a date or what have you the village offers apparel shopping at 29 high-end retailers such as athleta lululemon carhartt nike victoria's secret slash pink urban outfitters and white house black market The second and third floors of the buildings of the village are dedicated to office and commercial space. The village at Meridian opened in 2013 on Eagle Road and Fairview Avenue. Um, It's right across from the world's largest Albertson store, which I did not get footage of, but I'll probably throw a picture in here uh, that I download. At least last I heard it was the world's largest Albertsons. I'm assuming it still holds that title. And uh, actually for grocery store, just pretty cool. It's got like a, it's got a bar in there and a full on like food court and just a really cool place so between these two between the mall and albertson's there's just a ton of stuff to do right there on that corner so it'd be something you definitely would want to you know take the family spend the day what have you uh they just opened a half price books uh right there also so it's just a lot of stuff and then it's got a chick-fil-a so chick-fil-a is quickly becoming one of my favorite places i didn't eat there for a long time and i used to see cars just lined up for miles well i'm exaggerating but lined up like crazy and um so i decided i was going to check it out finally and Uh, The chicken there is just so moist. Not that this is a commercial for Chick-fil-A, but if you have an eight there, you definitely want to check it out. So So this is just a quick video. Um, I started with the village and then I'll add more videos to this series in the future. I would like to do like the old penitentiary, maybe the Idaho Botanical Gardens. I shot some footage there um, at Christmas time and I never released it, but it shows like the Idaho Botanical Gardens, but at night and it's all lit up. It's really a cool thing they do every year. Anyways, there's lots of stuff to do in the Boise area. If you have, you know, either just like I said, for a date or for a family, what have you. So this is just my way of kind of giving an example of what you can do. Anyways, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to hit the like or subscribe button. If not, that's fine too. I'll try harder next time. Maybe leave a comment. Be nice though. If it's a negative comment, I'm just going to delete it just being honest i've had a couple requests i haven't been able to get to and i will eventually so just stay tight anyways thanks a million i'm randy and i will see you guys hopefully next week all right talk to you later bye